Hello, welcome to YouTube video channel of RVMax.us. My name is Sachin Shaw. I'll give my number at the end and in the beginning here, 864-404-0054. Please text us. That's a great way to communicate. If you don't know how to text, no worries. Call us, leave us a voicemail, and we'll get back to you. So today we're going to present you 2019 Forester by Forest River, model 3125. It's about a 31 and a half feet long, a bunk, mo bunk motorhome, practically brand new. It's got 29,000 miles, about a year, year and a half old. Um, just a good motorhome, being only a year and a half, maybe two years old. Uh, so maybe a couple of small flaws I'll show, point out, but it's practically new. Look at the tires, a deep, uh, pretty, pretty neat deep trade on them, and they are, they were 39 of 17. It's probably on a 18 model Ford chassis being a 2019 motorhome. Got electric awning with the LED lights at the end. All the decals in good shape being only a couple of years old. Uh, don't have any, uh, you know, sun damage yet. It's not that old yet. Very clean. So it's a 3251 LE, 3251 Lima. Echo, solar ready, how about that? Um, that's your uh, air supply. It's got lots of underbelly storage. I'll show you a few of them. We just had it washed. It's got some water in it. But that's your LP tank. So. Passenger side, you got a huge slide out with the bunks. Deep storage here. So this storage under the big slide, it's a total pass-through storage. So you can put your long lawn chairs or flag poles or whatever, so it's completely passed through from this end to other end. So it's a Forester LE model. I guess that's supposed to be something really nice. It was one owner, we got it from another car dealership. It was a traded in over there. And that's how we got it. Have a 7,500 pound towing capacity Reese type three hitch with the electrical hookup. So you can probably tow some big boat or 7,500 pound is a are better than a 5,000 pound or 4,000, some of the Class C does. On top, it's got a solid fiberglass roof. We may do a little video with a drone, but it's really nice, new condition roof. So this is your pass-through storage. Got a lot more room here. I mean, you can almost put some foldable bicycles in here or some wide, tall items. Campground uh, TV hookups there. This should be a uh, wet bay, plumbing bay. Yep, it is. City water hookups, pretty simple. Money hole, gas hole. It has a six gallon water heater, direct spark ignition, electric. I don't know if it's got electric or not, but it's a gas. More storage, and it's got a one more under this slide. And over here, got 700 some odd, 720 hours on this QG generator, 4,000 watts. Runs really good. It also has a jack system. I guess we can show you that from inside, but let me go ahead and got power windows, 29,187 miles. It just basically turned 29,000 miles. Got a nice backup monitor, Sony with a Bluetooth system. Air conditioning is ice cold. Uh, let me let me repeat this uh, if I have not said it already. It's under warranty uh, for another 6,900 miles or 6,800 miles. Um, 33, 36, I think they, that's what they come with it. 
unless they're 350,000 miles, then it'll have more. But it is under Ford factory warranty on a powertrain. The V10 is in really, really good shape with the um, power windows. I think it's got power locks, remote control. So we made a complete circle. Let's go ahead and show you inside now. Come on in, this clean motorhome is odor free from any, uh... oh, this is my hat. There we go. All right. I love this weather right now. All right, so uh, coming inside this coach, by the way, I just looked up on the little website, RV USA. It has 60,000 miles, 60 months powertrain warranty. Bingo. 29,000 miles, you got 30,000 miles left. Even if it was uh, rolled out in eight, late 18, uh, you got, uh, I think usually when he's a title, that's when it starts. So you probably got another two, three years and 30,000 miles on an engine transmission, which V10, they, nothing goes wrong with them. Uh, so you got a little ladder right here. If you kind of see the picture, it hooks up in here for little kids to climb up in here and sleep. This is swivel around TV so you can push it back okay or you can bring it back out and swivel it around uh, it looks like a 40 something inch 42 inch at least nice size TV so two person can sleep up here this fall this thing folds down in the bed uh, this also folds up in the bed I believe uh, it does it's a jackknife also I like this part you watching TV, man, you can just kick back and relax. So it has a two recliners under it. Some drawers under this booth dinette area. This look like a tile, but it's a vinyl. Um, as you saw in the front, it looks it's it's very clean to, you know, doesn't have any major tear or wear with a 29,000 mile consistency. Back here we got a three burner gas stove, Magic Chef microwave oven, got a traditional oven, I like that. So you can recook your pizza in here or make some cookies or bake a cake, bake a cake. Uh, some counter space here with a big sink. Additional counter opens up here. Some cabinet reason stuff. I think I got my kitchen lights off. There we go. More lights. Double door refrigerator. As you step up here, we got a bunk slide, that big large slide back here. Uh, it's pretty neat. Got a bunk on top, but you know, kids can sit here. It also has a two, uh, <laughs> that made a loud noise. I guess nothing made for a 180 pound adult. <laughs> now I had it just open so it just snapped back in. You have two seat belts here. Uh, really nice, man. You can watch TV. TV's right there behind our camera lady. Um, you can play games, whatever. You know that's what kids like to do. Uh, but having a seat belt, you can have them put here while you're traveling down the road. You probably have some seat belts in that booth dinette too. This sofa, by the way, it opens up. There we go. Becomes bed. And here, when you want to sleep, another kid can sleep here. So lots of People can sleep in here, okay? Come around here, we got a, uh, before we go in the bathroom area, let me show you the bedroom slide that continues from a uh, bunk area, has lots of room with a 
coat closet on both sides. Uh, another TV hookup, if you'd like to, has a lots of cabinets. I'm not going to open them all. Has some room here. Uh, cabinets up, up above. Got an MCD nice shades. So it's a queen size bed with a both side. You have a little nightstand. So um, it does has does have a sliding door. Let me get in front of you. This brings a little privacy back in the bedroom. Ah, get free. No, no extra charge for a little squeak. Uh, here we go. Back, back in the uh, bathroom area. You got lots of counter space. Cabinet here. Another cabinet here. Some more cabinet on bottom. Look like a little laundry chute. Yep, it is. Drawers. Regular toilet. And we got a stand-up glass enclosed. Tub. A little small tub. How about that? So this will uh, conclude our video. Uh, what we'll do, we'll get on the highway. Oh, by the way, there is a curtain here too for privacy. We're going to get on the road and do a test drive on this thing. See how it drives. Let's get on the road. All right, here we go. Test drive on this 2019 Forester. It's around town. We're doing about 40 miles an hour. Steer straight. Runs, runs really well. Um, what we'll do, we'll get on the highway and kind of give you feedback how it drives on the highway in just a short while. And we'll check the cruise control, all that stuff. Easy to drive. What's the difference in Class A diesel, what we mainly sell? Occasionally we get this Class C's. Class C's are a little easy to drive um, compared to big Class A. You know, ride cap ride quality may be different. It's like a little van, okay? So here we go. Getting on the highway. 40... 50 and almost 60. There we go, 60 miles an hour. 65. You're going to get the best fuel mileage at 65. They say 60 to 65. Almost doing 70 now. Let's, let's turn our cruise on. Cruise has engaged at about 68 miles an hour or so, a little under 70. Runs straight, dead center. Is then pulling left, right. Uh, runs really well. So uh, let's see, to sum up this motorhome, 2019 Forester, 29,000 miles, under factory warranty, up to 60,000 miles. And that's on engine, transmission, powertrain. We do sell warranty. If you like to buy warranty comprehensive on a coach side, we can sell a warranty for three, four, five, six years. Um, at least I know five years, uh, 60,000 miles, we could sell a powertrain or coach only warranty. We help you to get finance. We do take trades. Um, this Class C sleeps a whole bunch of people. You saw it. It's got a bunk, booth dinette, sofa. I mean, it, it'll sleep, I don't know, eight, nine, ten people. A bunk on the top. Yeah, maybe 10 or 12. I don't know. Uh, run, runs really well, got good miles, uh, about 700 hours on generator, got leveling jacks. Um, let's see what else I could add. My phone number, thank you, 864-404-0054. That number again is 864-404-0054 or our son, Mayan, 864-376-5600. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're about to get to 10,000 subscriber mile marker, and he keeps saying he's going to have some special video for it. Please subscribe to our channel, and uh, I think you can you can turn a notification on. By that way, whenever we put new video on, uh, you get to see it. Thanks for watching our video, and uh, God bless you. Have a great day. Thank you.